Hi everybody, welcome back to Borderlands 2. My name is Mikey Dubs and today we are taking Maya through the ultimate randomized roguelands. Let's do this. So, ultimate randomized roguelands, what does that mean? It means all the gear, besides the, uh, the starting gear, means all the gear becomes completely random. That's to include class mods, that's to include guns, and we've also included our skills. Maybe one day I'll make a guide of how to install all these mods, but these are just all Python SDK database mods that are available to PC Borderlands players. Alright, so... The class mods, we actually take, we'll probably take a look at after we know what skills we have. Okay, Grenages are almost all liars, but we'll see. That seems pretty decent if it does if it does okay damage. 2.2 milli, decent fuse time. Electric grenade, electric gr Ooh, I kind of like that. Hopefully it does good damage. A slag kiss of death, let's see. Might be a fakey. Looks like a fake grenade to me. Contraband skyrocket, let's be a little bit careful here. We're dead. Okay, we live. That one is not going to be... <laughs> that one's not going to be viable for us. I do not believe that. That one seems a little bit on the danger side. Let's go to the electric grenade. I mean, it does 2.0 2. mil, 2.0 mil. And you just zap someone with it. I mean, that seems like it's going to be pretty decent. All right, our first gun. Well, technically, we looked at this gun first. All right, let's see it. It's a shotgun. It's going to do about 1.8 milli, maybe 1.9 milli per shot at a one at a one not even a shot per second or how about this pitchfork it's not going to do very much damage either to be honest with you these are pretty weak early offerings from the game i don't think this will be very good and i don't think this pitchfork will be very good either we got a hundred percent corrode chance though which is kind of interesting what can we up there oh yeah let's see Shields. I'm looking at mainly stats. This one seems pretty good. If it if it does neo-generator things with those stats, I think that's really, really strong. Might be the one that we go for long term. Okay, so we didn't get any good guns. I'm I'm refusing to die because honestly, this is not my first attempt recording this video. I have been getting gypped and screwed over um, pretty consistently. So, I'm not messing around right now. If the game doesn't give me a randomized gun that I think is any good, then I'm going to traditional guns. I, that's just how it's going to have to be. So, we'll try these two. As soon as they stop working, we're going to a surge strike or an injector or a, a nerve strike. I think the nerve strike is going to be my overall best weapons, best weapon. But now, we have to make our decision for skills. Let's go see what enemies we get first. We'll see our enemies. We're gonna get. We're gonna have to go, go through armor and start, then pr then primarily shields after that. I see Reaper in the far right tree. Just give me a second to make my actual decision here. Interspersed outburst is a nice tier two skill. No kill like overkill goes crazy. Willing is an amazing shield skill in combo with preparation. In prop in combo with Mylan. And getting ruin early on is nasty. Just so good and converge. Beautiful. This is the skill tree I want to be in. It goes Reaper into Converge into Ruin. And beyond that, I don't think I don't think we'll have any problems after that. Just for a while. We're I think we're lacking a little bit of overall damage. We're gonna be taking things like probably headshot. Willing, but still doesn't give me much damage. Rising shots actually, it being a capstone makes a little bit of sense to me here because of how much we need gun damage in this tree. I'm not gonna set myself on fire, I don't think. We do have a kind of interesting, you know, a, 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 it's not terrible, but like an interesting melee setup. But onslaught's gonna be sick too. Okay, so we're gonna need to do a little bit of. Let's go up and try to farm the chests. We need our first five points into Reaper. Give me that gun damage. It's a simple gun loader. No crit. No damage. There we go. You're gone. Give me that Iridium. Okay, run for my life. Run for my life. Run for my life. Get some cover. Get some cover. These enemies have randomized weapons. That's why it's so difficult. Because this gun is shooting like a hail. There we go. This should be doing some decent damage now. 
I think that you can get stuck in here, so I don't want to get too far deep in there. But what I do want to do is get these these t enemies fighting against one another. That would be great. Let's go for the angelic guard first. Gr you're gonna oh nice grenade toss. You gonna say this guy doesn't even know how to toss grenades? How, how about my grenades? Oh that'll that'll do some things. Yeah, there we go. Excuse me, that was rude of you. Go up. And then go down. I see that, um... Oh, that's... It's not Mopey's candy. That's... Come on, I'll get it. I'll know. I know this. I know this. I know this. Okay. Juso's is... Yeah, is the melee one. Is Pyrex blue candy? It might be. Okay. That would be pretty sick if I could save it for next round, to be honest with you, though. I can utilize it next round. Yeah, that's good damage. And it's going to help me shred those Clash Stalkers. Well, they did until I ran out of grenades, obviously. No and I'm out of ammo. Get over here! Get over here! There we go. So, it's Pyrex candy. I knew it. Got it. Okay, we're going to save it for next round. Bandit damage. Jacob's... Oof, no. I don't think, unless we get a Jacobs that has really bad accuracy and everything else is pog and champing, that's going to be useless. Max health relic, mm-mm. We farm, we farm, we farm again. I, I'm not against grabbing regular guns that are good. Let's see. A diamond sniper rifle, it's Hyperion, which means it's probably buns. I mean, based on the stats, it looks kind of buns to me. Surely this stage will offer me something that can Bandit immediately makes sense to me though. It's a bandit overkill and I have a bandit relic so These guns get randomized so I don't get a choice of either one of these I just kind of get to pick one and then when it enters my Inventory becomes a fibber which its damage is so low. It's just not gonna do it for me but this overkill if I put on a Bandit reload speed relic this overkill should re reload really fast. That looks better to me. I don't have a class mod on. I should probably should have grabbed a class mod when I was uh, had class mods back there, but it's fine. We'll find a class mod in no time, probably. See so a diamond transaction. This is a randomized gun. Its fire rate is pretty slow. Its damage is not so great. Probably not taking it. Class mod. See, told you. Okay, plus five in Reaper. We take those plus six in Reaper. Thank you. Okay. Hmm. I think I'd, I'd stick with the skill that I have for now. Just the extra weapon damage is kind of sick. Oh, and I have Reaper. That's going to make Converge a lot better. It actually gives me a reason to put points into Helios. I like that a lot, actually. It fits the streak, it fits the, the style of the build. So this gun's fire rate is pretty slow, but it's a. It's a 4.7 4. million damage per shot sniper. If I land it, it's pretty interesting. How the the well, you shoot that though. You have a good touch. This might heal us. And the weapon I'm going to be replacing is let's see, my slot three is my overkill. My slot four is my TDR launcher. I don't want to get rid of my launcher, but. Spots are tough. Spots are tough when you're playing fully randomized. Tell you what. Okay, melee damage, override cooldown rate. Not that useful. If I had scorn, maybe. Fight for my lifetime. That's something I'm somewhat interested in. If I start going chain down. Okay, so I want to try launchers, but the thing is, launchers are inherently nerfed. I think that this, as a slot four launcher, though, is something that I am interested in keeping. Until I get something better. So my slot three, my overkill's up for grabs right now. And you know what? Now that we do have some guns to try out, let's actually switch back to the cooldown rate. And Hel Helios and Reaper will come in handy. So let's go. Let's get on out of here. Three, two, one, grab. I the boneyard. Should be some skags. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, let's see if this corrosive sniper can do this. That should be a one shot. Oh, close. Okay. Now Helios comes in. Super sick. 
Let's try this other gun. This all I have is corrosive guns. Uh, sir, I'm all corrosive up. Corrosive, corrosive, corrosive. I, I, those were the only guns I thought were really worth trying at this point. That's fine. We can we can go mage build. I'm not against mage build. Overkill should obviously do huge things. Let's try this again. Not bad. But these guys don't have randomized HP bars, so. Now this gun seems like it could do some nice things for us. Let's swap it out for this one. It is burst though. But its damage is relatively high. This this weapon does not seem good at all. So we're not going it. Let's see. Cooldown rate forty two percent. And TDR, TDR mag size is actually kind of been sick, sick and nasty. If we can get ourselves like a really good TDR mag, like, except that this TDR, it says TDR on the side. Is it TDR? It's doll. Do I have anything TDR? Yeah, I have this fibber, which max size is 32,000. What? Will it, will it throw reload? It will, but its max size is not 32,000. Like it says in the card. The card does lie there. But I could put on TDR magazine size and make it a, a pretty big TDR magazine size. TDR magazine. Oh, baby, come back. You can blame it all on me. So these guns are not randomized because they're from the, the pressure pad. This, that is from the same pool as the starter weapons. Yes, guns, okay. Gross of hail, pretty high damage, pretty good fire rate. Let's throw it in slot one, Let's see what it does. Looks a little bit fake to me, okay. Landscaper, very high accuracy. Its damage is not so great. And it's fake. True lane, as soon as I pick this up, I'm gonna get slagged, right? No, I'm not getting slagged so far. Let's see, an Avenger, it's a Malawan. Will this regen my SMG ammo? It is not. How's this damage though? Not the best damage for a pretty hefty ammo consumption cost. Okay. What did we get from this one? We got guns. Cool, cool, cool. So I need better guns. Ah oh, man. It's not even a milli per second. It's all about fire rate, it's all about damage and projectiles. So this slag kitten, if it's real, could be pretty good. I think that could be okay. We'll try it as our as our main source of damage next next uh, fight. Thermogenic Thunderball Fist. Doesn't seem terrible. We'll shoot it. Ooh. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Its effect seems pretty sick. It's initial damage might not be the greatest. Skags. I'm blow. Skagaruskis. Okay. Oh. Okay. Any any loot skags? Oh my gosh, you just got one tapped. So did you. Okay, we got grenades, but I kinda like my grenades right now, to be honest with you. I hate you. <laughs> what do you even do? actually kind of a cool grenade. See the slob Tesla? Oh, yeah. oh, okay. It does. It's a fire burst. Okay, we got ourselves a fire burst. What a fireball. It actually is a fireball grenade, which, it, which isn't the best. Bouncing Bonnie. It's fake. You're a fake. You're a fraud. Okay, let's see if this loads in. If it doesn't load in right here, I would find it way too hard to find. So. Let's go back to my... My grenade of choice, which is this electric grenade, and then all the other grenades that I have. Let's just let's just do do do, do them the dirty. Ready? Pow 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 pow. This one says that slot says empty, so I'm not gonna mess around with it. Okay, I think we can F two to continue. Did I already get the relic? I did not. Let's grab that. 
Hey. I might have already gotten my rewards from it. I do have a decent amount of iridium already. All right, so for my next point, it's obviously going to be ruin. Now, we're going to have some decisions to make. Because nothing is, Im like, immediately urgent. However, I think expertise is a decent skill, but so is grit. So maybe we go grit into interspersed outburst. That'll give us access to willing, a good defense, and no kill like overkill. Milan's a great skill. It is, don't get me wrong. But there's nothing else in this tree that I can immediately get to right away. Meanwhile, I could go for grit for now. And then I will be able to couple that with more damage later on. With interspersed outburst, of course, being super good. Of course, I switched, switched to fire guns. But we do have a, this slag gun, which I think will be pretty good. And we have ruin now, which is sick. Super good. Of course, yeah, now that I'm... I swapped guns to non-corrosive guns. This gun seems okay. This one seems like it was doing some strange things. It looks like it has Thunderball Fist on it. You go up. Whoa! Okay, I'm, I might be dead. I live, though. I live. I live those. The armored enemies were not something I was looking forward to. Oh, but we do get our... Our candy. Let's grab it and use it this round. Because I think I might have forgotten to use it the last round. Oh, yeah. Let's go. Anybody? Oh, uh, maybe not the best round to actually use it. Yeah, because I think I might have lost it already. Oh, I go down. Shoot. Gonna get you. Gotcha. Like I said. Go, oh, yeah. That, that, um, Pyrex candy. I'm crazy. Drop them and bop them. Slag them and bag them. Very clean. And you go up. And then you go down. I should get a corrosive dot on him. Yeah, there we go. All right, see the stinger? Doesn't have the highest damage. I mean, it's a 6.7 milli, but it's a launcher. My launcher, I think, just does things a little bit differently. You know what I'm saying? I'm just going to throw reload it. Okay, shotgun damage you take. Incendiary, explosive, and slag. That's actually not a bad one. Shield capacity and recharge rate. I mean, if we want to go with the biggest shield in the history of the world, we could. Okay, this pyrophobia. I think this slag gun stays. This pyrophobia. This gun can probably go. This CDR can definitely go, probably. Okay. This one, this gun does not have the highest damage, but it's got decent fire rates. If it's usable, it's usable. If it's not, it's not. Let's see. I think it's. I think it might be us usable. And it, you throw it like a TDR. Okay. I think it's usable. Let's see. Sir so Hammerlock's Rex, a shotgun with eight hundred thousand times five, with a slow fire rate, unless it does something really unique. I think we replace it. I just don't know which one to replace. The slag pistol was good. It wasn't insanely good. This is my launcher. Ah, man, no. We'll swap out the slag pistol. Cause we're still looking for that one A, you know. We're looking for that one A weapon. That is lovely. And if it keeps spitting me out launchers, it's just not going to be it. Cause launchers are, are inherently nerfed in this mode. So I can get a launcher. That's a pistol, you know. Give me up and over. Ooh, what you got there? I'm not taking that. I like my grenade as it stands. Alright, did I forget any chests? Everything good? I got one. One left. Melee override. Shield recharge rate. Tenacity relic. It's honestly not a bad... Because... Not a bad relic. Because we are kind of in down bad for... Some offense, and if we don't get offense, we might have to start tapping into fight for our life, which is not something we obviously want to do. Okay, what do we got to try? This this TDR. Well, that was a bad test, but yeah, I like it. Whoa, you guys, these guys are getting messed up. I also want to try out this doll against fleshy enemies. Interspersed outburst is definitely going to make our damage feel up higher with anything we use. 
Okay, you guys chill out for a second. Okay. Really high damage. They're really doing things quickly. Slag damage plus 42% is going to go insanely nuclear. Okay, let's see. It's an interfacer. Its damage is not so bad. Oh, man. I just took slag damage, and I immediately get some really nice slag damage weapons. So, let's see. Interfacer. It's... Its ammo cost isn't so high. It just doesn't have the highest damage in the world. Is this a problem? This one is... I was going to have to drop reload this gun anyway. But it is... It is a sniper. Okay. Slag damage is officially our number one right now. Please do magic missile things. You don't. <laughs> All the, all the grenades in this mode are just simply lies. So unless I have a grenade damage, you know, build going, I'm just inclined not to try. Okay, these guns seem fairly tame, you know, fairly tame. Let's go ahead and take off the grenade that we just tried. Go back to the electric grenade. Mm. Slight, this slight kitten should be better now. It didn't do that much damage against those armored enemies before, but now that we have some bonus slag damage to work with, you know, maybe it'll do some things for us. Let's see, what do we get? Melee override and melee override, okay. Whoa, 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 chill, chill, chill. That's not terrible damage to the birth. And I also have one bullet not hitting, I think. Okay, not bad, not bad. Put you up. And then shortly after, the, the hopes of putting you down. Something is healing me, and it might be this gun. It's really not bad damage. Yeah, this gun is healing me, I think. So if this gun is also healing me, that's a really, really, really big deal. Okay, so we got plus seven sweet release and elated, so we can get some kind of crazy class mods. In fact, because of that class mod just got re-rolled, I'm going to go check it out. Oh. Imagine getting... Oh, this one has plus 6 in Helios and plus 6 in Reaper. That's an upgrade. That's nice. That's good stuff. Very cool. Alright, let's open up this bad Larry. And then we'll head out. Next stage me. Any weapon could be amazing. It's just the fibers... There's so low damage. We got a grog nozzle here. Let's just take it in case it does do grog nozzle things. Okay, this volcano actually has pretty good damage. Decent fire rates. This damage is a lot lower than my current. Yeah. But the fire rate is much higher. Yeah, and it looks kind of cool. Like, it does pretty cool explosive stuff, so that's kind of cool. All right, so interspersed outburst, then no kill like overkill, then willing. From here, I don't really know where I'm going. Res is useless. So. Okay, Mount Scarab Research Center. Let's fight ourselves a boss. We're entering boss phases now. Okay. This gun seems pretty good. Let's go back to our, our boy, Mr. Dahl. Okay, that's not doing as much damage. This gun seems like a fake. It's the grog nozzle though, so we're just using it for grog nozzle things. This gun seems pretty good. It's kind of messing this dude up. And he resists, I think. I'm trying to read it, see? He's getting messed up though. Let's lock them over there. And we continue. Okay, give me some good loot here. What if I just took like one shot with a fire gun? You know, just like one. Where's my super high fire damage? This one? Maybe? 
Yeah, it was, I think. Very good. All right, what you drop for me? It's a Fire Infinity. Its max size is two. Whoa, hey, what's up? This gun came flying. It was like, use me, use me. I'm a 55 magazine. Tidior with a good reload speed. Fine, brother. Fine, you can be on the squad for a moment. This Diab is a... This damage is pretty good, but it's Jacob's. So I got to fire as fast as I can pull the trigger. I mean, maybe. No, it's it's magazine size is pitiful. Okay, let's see. Bad relic, orphan maker, curse of the orphans. Right, if I shoot this, it's not damaging me. I don't think it's firing anything. Okay. So you were let down. Yes, I was. This gun's not shooting anything either. All these guns. They can't break the box. That's strange. Can any of these guns open the box? Let's try this one. It's got a it's got the gearbox rifle skin. There we go. That's very strange. Oh, trespasser? Yeah, that's just a really good utility gun to grab. Okay. None of these are randomized, so. What is the Jolly Rogers damage? I'm, I'm, I'm curious, because this is a pretty high damage bandit shotgun, right? What are its stats compared to the, these randomized ones? So it's pretty high damage. I mean, it, to me, it looks like it's about 4 million per shot. If you hit all pellets with a mag decent magazine size and a slow fire rate. Okay. It's something. I know parts can can matter a lot. What's that? What's the grip on this thing? This thing has a Torg grip. And a Jacob stock, I think. Alright, let's grab our points. This is where we have to start making some decisions. I still think willing is probably the best skill. We are going to be a little bit light on damage. But Kinetic Reflection, actually... Getting kill skill reflex is, is pretty nuts. Onslaught makes a lot of sense too. Let's go ahead and start putting points into this skill tree. Five or six shots is a, is a decent skill. Kinetic Reflection, Onslaught, these could be all very, very powerful skills as we still have a long way to go in this run, hopefully. Murderlin's Temple. Okay, drop them all. Oh, the super bad fire rate in that gun. Okay, let's just use this bad boy and try to live. Okay, grit saving my life. How many times there? A bajillion? I want to try out this, um, this grog nozzle to see if it will heal me a bunch. So let's, let's equip it. It will. Perfect. So we have our, this thing is locked in this slot too. Absolutely locked in. In fact, it might just stay as my primary. So we can do full mage build. Okay, did we finally get a gun? Is this finally a gun? Like an actual good gun? Please be real. You, you're going to slot 1A. Oh my, Lanta. Okay, here's... It takes up a lot of sniper ammo, so it's not going to be that crazy. But we got ourselves, in my opinion... Please, please still be a sniper rifle relic. Jacob's recoil now. Do I have like... Do I have like um, sniper max ammo or something? It's a... It's a Vlad off. Okay. Vlad off anything? No, we stick with cooldown then. Okay. Hopefully... Hopefully... And it's... It's reload is... It's reload is four seconds. We can manage that. And it's fire rate is slow, but it does a ton of damage. Yeah, it is 2 million times 23. So like what, 13 milli? So I'm, so I'm thinking with that gun. 13 milli per shot. Okay, sustenance, no, we don't need. Reaper is what we're going for. Fire rate and chain reaction is actually okay for us because I think we have chain reaction over here. We do. So... Okay, so let's do... Let's grab our Iridium from the Token of Wealth. Thank you. 
Although, when you find the token of wealth, the, the side objective marker does not... The side objective marker does not indicate that you have found it. That's okay. Okay. Now we can take our next five. Five or six shots. We're actually going to need that quite a bit. And let's do gun damage on kill. Come on. We, please tell them we have found. And it's slag too. And it's slag. And we have the slag damage relics. I, I, I know we do. Come on. The relics do get randomized though when they enter inventory, which is super sad. Gotta be careful with that. What's up, homie? We go all sniper grenades because we're grog nozzling. And from there, let's go pistol, shotgun, SMG. What do you got? It's a pretty interesting gun, but I don't have the inv the I can't sustain the the shooting so. Let's go see who we get. Three, two, one. We get Hyperius. Okay. Here we go. Let's try to do this. That's not bad damage. It's not, it's not a bad first burst. We will. We are going to run out of damage. Uh, we are going to run out of ammo, though. A big, a bad thing about this fight right now for me is that... Um, no kill skills are going to be available to me. But I have faith in our in our movement speed. Oh, and I have I can I can I can pull them in and do damage to all of them at one time. Like I said, I don't think that's bad damage to the boss. I understand that's with Reaper active with 11 points in it, so. Okay, you go down. And the longer this fight goes, the the more damage the raid will deal to me. I wish I had boar really bad right now. Or yeah, just if, if I had boar for this fight, be insanely good. Can't afford to be taking two shots on that trash. Got you. Got you again. I'm almost out of uh, ammo in this sniper rifle. Which is a tragedy in unto itself. What do we got? We got this corrosive gun. This should be okay, right? I'm reflecting a lot of damage though, and get letting him get a lot of Novas off. But I'm okay, because I have I have pretty good healing in the form of Grog nozzle. This gun's pretty good. I think it's pretty good. Is it, does it, is it automatic? It is cool. There we go. We have the damage for this. Bring it on down. Boom, boom, boom. Did you tell me? Yeah, he's he's not happy, actually. Oh, okay, okay. Uh, I'm sorry about what I did to you. This is our last kill skill that we're going to be able to get here. Okay, let's tag him. Let's try to bag him as quickly as possible here. If we get in trouble, if we get in trouble, we switch to our grog and toss nades or do whatever. The phase lock's going to hurt him, too. Okay, that he's getting he's getting lower, lower and lower. It's always worth taking the shot even when he's not slagged. His interspersed outburst will proc. Okay, we're gonna get the tier one done here, I think. That's all we need to do. Because then our weapons get re-randomized anyway. So we just gotta pray for decent loot. And that our skills can hopefully carry us. That's a big part of it, too. We've got pretty good skill tree, I would say. Not access to a ton of healing, but we got a pretty good skill tree to work with. Okay, later, kiddo. Okay, let's get all the iridium. We're not too worried about the guns. What I might do is just collect some of them. I might collect some of them. 
and see after the after the nerf apocalypse happens between rounds or between stages if i if i had managed to roll something like incredible with a bunch of either huge damage or bonus projectiles or a, fa a fire rate to compensate for not having either of those but typically you need to have you know fire rate projectiles and base damage all high is what i'm looking for let's take a but the thing is that the shotguns are a little bit tricky because it's like they have so many other downsides if this if this antagonist works as intended then it'll be really good fears that it doesn't okay oh there's also a loot room back there we're not gonna worry about the loot room though let's, let's get out let's get out of here oh trivia time let's go hopefully they added more trivia questions i haven't done it which food did handsome jack think sucks is it is it pretzels let's go let's go let's go okay who drops the gub Laney. Oh my gosh, I'm two for two. Bring it on. Well, Legendary can Wilhelm drop. That's a Logan's gun. The, don't anyone who's like, oh, you only play Roguelands. You don't have actual Borderlands knowledge. I'm a three for three. It's, uh, to be fair, the first two were guesses. And the third one, I just know that one because of Sham Flea strats. And I've fought in Wilhelm enough times, guys. All right, so Nerf Apocalypse happens. Miss Moxie's nothing. Slag, nothing. This corrosive volcano did manage to come out slightly okay. Uh, my relic is still cooldown, right? Which is cool. My grenade is... And we'll see what my grenade is. It's nothing. Very cool. How about this one? That one came out... It, hey, it came out as something. It, 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 it's going to do something. Just, just be done bouncing. Okay. I don't think it actually does anything. I don't, want to, I don't want to freak out my game by doing too much, so. I've had crashes. Okay, my shield, right now, it still looks like an antagonist. Still looks really, really good. So, we're going to keep it on. Okay, we got other grenades to try. Thank you. That one looks fake. Sticky long bomb. It's not a sticky long bomb at all. This fuse time is... Whoa, whoa, whoa! That doesn't seem fair to me. We 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 lose the run like that. Well, that's gonna be it for this video. Thank you all very much for watching. It is a bit of a shorter video, but starting a new one would push us way over the top, and this is how it's just gonna have to be. We learned that uh, trying out grenades in this part is maybe not the fastest, or not maybe not the safest thing in the world. I'll see y'all next time. Bye.